guys here? Hey, you guys here? Okay, cool. Hey, what's up? Uh, I'm back again with a new video. But uh, I just want to kind of brag again. I mean, because for me, it's pretty awesome if I can find the page. But uh, I was featured in this magazine right here. Check me out. I don't know if you can see that, if it's focusing on it. But uh, I shot those. I did that. Pretty great. But um, before I go any further, if you like this video or you liked any previous video, make sure you subscribe, like, leave a comment. It helps get me out there, helps promote. Hope you like the quality of this one better than the last one. Trust me, it's only gonna get better from here. So, um, a few weeks ago, I had people ask me questions, Brian photography, Woods. whatever, <laughs> just to see what people wanted to ask me and I told you I was gonna do a video. Probably didn't believe me, but guess what? Here it is. So, let's check it out. What's up? It's your boy X with the flags. Now tell me, who do it best? Nobody, that's who. So forget about it. Um, quick water break. Excuse me. Uh, side note, no, this video is not sponsored by Poland Spring. Not sponsored by Poland Spring. I just needed some water. So, yeah, a few weeks ago, I went about and I had people ask me some questions and photography or whatever. A lot of them were photography based. So, you're gonna see the questions pop up right here. So, you know, just check out the answers I got for them. And if you recognize your question, go ahead and say, hey, that's my question. Anywho, first question was, what immediate goal are you working toward as a photographer? So I guess the immediate goal for me that I'm working towards is just, I guess you could say to be a better photographer when it comes to lighting, and things like that and not just being put in put in a box that I can only do one sort of video or one sort one sort of um, type of photography <clears throat> my goal is to be a well-rounded photographer good with editing good with lighting good with indoor shoots and outdoor shoots so I guess you can say that's my overall goal, goal that I'm working towards <sighs> next question was asked by my boy Rob. I'm gonna give him a shout out because sidebar, he supports me heavy and I appreciate it. He's one of my biggest supporters and it doesn't go unnoticed. Um, it costs you nothing to support and he does it to the max. And I wish I could pay him because that's how, how much he supports me. But his question is most difficult shoot or shoots? Um, <laughs> so, 
this question is kind of it's a good question but i guess my most difficult shoot was i was doing an engagement shoot <laughs> and they wanted me to do a silhouette and honestly i was like i don't even know how that is done so at first i was like a silhouette what's a silhouette but then i was i looked it up like i had to look it up right there on the spot because silhouettes only work basically like when the sun's going down like that's when you gotta catch the silhouette so i had to look it up on my phone and i was like all right let me see if i can figure this out figure this out blah, blah, blah. It took me a while. I sort of got it, but um, it didn't come out great, but better than I thought it would, being it my first time, if that makes sense. And I hope that answers your question. <coughs> Next question is from a photographer friend of mine from Virginia. He says, how do you handle lost co clients? Uh... <laughs> So I haven't really dealt with too many, too much of, too much of that losing count clients, but it's, I mean, it's a live and learn lesson. If I lost a client, then I just work harder to do better, if that makes sense, so that the next client has no choice but to hire me. Like I'm the best option. So. That kind of ties in with one of my goals, like to be a well-rounded photographer so that when it comes to it, you're like, oh, I'm the best option. Like I have to go with him. Next question. And this is from my boy Meek. Um, favorite area to shoot. So <laughs> there was a period of time where like these last few months where I was shooting at this train station. And I was shooting at the train station because one, it had so many different spots that you can do, different angles you can come from, so many different opportunities and images you can capture. Like if you could see it, like one location can be used for multiple shoots, but you just have to, that creative mind so I guess my favorite honestly my favorite area to shoot would be like I guess you could say a city like city like because I feel like when you go to like cities you have so much to work with so much because you could go from abandoned buildings to well populated areas you could go to very high, I guess high techy, I guess you can say buildings. And then you could go to an old school like brownstone or brick building. Yeah, so I guess cities would be my favorite area to shoot. So, favorite lens. <laughs> uh, as of right now, because it's the only lens I use, it's gonna be the 35, um, 35 L series. It's a wide angle lens, and it's my favorite because you can do a lot. Like if you want to get headshots, you can get headshots. I'm using it right now to do my video. Every like I was saying in my previous video, every shoot I've done in the last year has been with this lens that I'm currently filming on now. Um, yeah, this lens right here, the 35. And it's the greatest lens that I ever purchased and I regret nothing. Nothing, I tell you, nothing. That being said, after this one, it would be the 50 because I like how the 50 does certain things like each lens has their own particular style and like if you like to shoot in a certain style a certain lens would probably work best for you so I mean teach his own uh, 
<laughs> this next question right. is <laughs> kind of funny. So they asked me, uh, what is your biggest pet peeve as a photographer? <laughs> I'm sorry, I laughed. So <clears throat> one of my biggest pet peeves is, um, and I might get, I might get some looks for this, but I don't care. Uh, is like people who flake. Oh, I'm probably gonna go on for two minutes, so I'm gonna try to control myself. But, uh, listen, if you don't wanna shoot or if you can't make it, just tell me straight up. Like, that's my biggest pet peeve. I hate when they say, oh, yeah, we good, we can shoot, and then I get there and you don't show up. Weird. You pick the time, you pick the place. Why aren't you here? Anyway, <laughs> that's my biggest pet peeve is uh, models who flake because I'm a big uh, believer in my time is valuable. Your time is valuable. Every Time is the one thing we can't afford to waste because once we spend it, we can't get it back. So I don't like my time wasted and I won't waste your time. But <laughs> yeah, that's my biggest pet peeve. That question was kind of funny. But anyway, so I'm gonna do this again. Drop your ideas in the comments below so that whatever video I do next, it could possibly be one of your ideas. It can possibly be one of your ideas. So leave a comment, like, subscribe, share it with somebody. If you wanna make fun of me in the comments, guess what? I don't care. So leave a comment. Side note, I have gear. And if you wanna purchase any of my apparel or anything, this isn't one of them. I like this, cause it says, creates. But this is not mine. Uh, <coughs> but I do have my own gear, and if you wanna check it out, hit that link below. Um, hey, do that thing. I'm gonna get out of here. But for real. If you want to hear, um, next video will be one of your ideas, I promise. So check it out. Yeah, that's about it, I think, yeah. We out of here.